to one actually live on Sky Sports um, in the yeah, UK, the UK listeners. And of course, every game is on uh, your CBS is your Foxes. But for the UK fans in particular, it's actually a very uh, high profile AFC matchup now. And that's the Pittsburgh Steelers traveling to, uh, of course, AFC Championship uh, runners up, uh, the Buffalo Bills. Um, this is a game, uh, Jamie, that I'm thinking. Look at what my co-presenter put. They put my, uh, this game to be a lot, um, as I say, like a, a big gap between the two teams. Whereas I feel like, but the Buffalo Bills will win. Uh, they've just got more firepower than Pittsburgh. But Pittsburgh are not a team for me. That it's just in their DNA. They don't get fresh, if you like. They don't get beaten badly. They may be losing heavily, and then they'll come back. But they've left themselves too much to do. And it's exactly how I see this game going. I just think the Bills will run away with it early on. Then with the sort of um, susceptibilities in the defence, Steelers will come back at them. But with time running out, uh, I reckon this one will be 35-28 to the Bills. I was actually quite surprised you called this a big game. Um, it is a bang average franchise in the Pittsburgh Steelers with the squad that they've got, the team they've got at the moment, going up against um, an actual up-and-coming, one of the best franchises right now. Um, so I'm surprised you said it was a big game. I'm surprised it's on Sky Sports. Out of all the games to pick, I wouldn't have picked this one as, as an entertaining one. Um, entertaining because I like watching Steelers lose, um, as everyone does. <laughs> yeah. Um, so I've gone Bills uh, 28, Steelers 17. Um, well, big, that, that's big still a lot closer. I'm going to go two interceptions for Big Ben as well. So. Well, you're, you're being very generous, aren't you? Uh, on, on this Wednesday uh, evening, well, the um, but I'll, I'll say our uh, c- contributors are being a lot less generous. Brad has gone for Buffalo to win 45 14, and uh, uh one, of his, also... one of his close mates is a Steelers fan as well, so that makes sense why he's gone there. 45. Yeah, I did, I did actually cop that actually. <laughs> but it, and the comment that Brad, uh, Brad sort of left a load of comments, some only some were appropriate for the show, but this one he just simply put uh, John. Josh Allen masterclass, Big Ben disaster class. So thank you for that, Brad. Awesome. Um, and Jack has gone for uh, Bill to also win 28 10. I mean, so, you know, big, and, big Ben will sling it a bit and you'll get a couple of touchdowns, but that's, that's it. Yeah. And, and, and that's the point about the sort of thing. It's in these real big games against the teams that are going to be challenging for your championships and your Super Bowls. Uh, it, it, it's been, as I say, the same under, um, as I say, the sort of current leadership in Pittsburgh. They've all, all always uh, like fall short, so they've get an easy run into the division round or the AFC Championship. Come up against, uh, as I say, New England when New England were far superior and lose every time. You could always be confident as a Patriots fan of beating uh, the Pittsburgh Steelers, and this is what the, the likes of your Buffalo Bills, Ravens, and Kansas City Chiefs are now. The Steelers are still really at uh, that prize made uh, fr- like franchise compared to what they used to be. Yeah, and we we also. Did a, a... Steelers special about four or five years ago, where it's just about how the fate, I think it was, it was literally called like the failure of the Pittsburgh Steelers. And it's um, yeah. just a, pretty much we just go into the Steelers about 45 minutes. Again, I know Pittsburgh fans just don't hate, like, it's, you know, just accept that's the level that you're on now. You're just yeah. more, more you, the, above average now. Yeah. You, you, had, you had your uh, uh, good years where none of your, your fans were born. It, it, you know what I mean? It's history, brilliant, but now you're just, you are pretty irrelevant. Just waving the yellow flag. Get on Sky now again, that's it. Yeah. <laughs> waving those flags. 